female killing violent son Matthew Fisher Turner was the right thing to do, says father Ernest Fisher by Joanna Menegg. H updated June 15, 2018 1809 and 24 seconds photo Matthew Fisher Turner was fatally stabbed by his father at their Perth home, Fa. Spook R.I.P. Matthew Fisher Turner Related story I stabbed him until I knew he was dead father planned sons AFL Gra. N.D. Final murder Court told related story Woman helped dispose of brother's body to protect her dad Court told related Story Sisters called triple zero because of stabbed brother's threats Court told related story We need to bury him Dig it deep father murdered son to avoid missing AFL Grand Final. Court told map, Parmelia 6167 a Perth man who fatal. Lie stabbed his son laughed and joked with police as he told them he thought he did the right thing because the 23 year. Old was a complete arsehole who regularly physically assaulted him and terrorized his family. Ernest Fisher, 67, ma. Did the comments in an interview with police recorded four weeks after Matthew Fisher Turner was last seen alive on AFLG. Ran final day in October 2016. The interview was shown today to the WA Supreme Court where Mr. Fisher is on trial for H. His son's murder and two of his other children, Joshua, 28, and Hannah, 21, are facing charges for allegedly trying to co- Ver up the crime. Mr. Fisher initially said his son had told him he had traveled to the eastern states with a hot chick. But after about an hour and a half of questioning, he finally admitted it was me. I'm the one who killed him, he asked. Ed police if they had found him, and when they replied no, he told them he is in the back garden. I'd had enough O. Oh. F him, stabbing own son not pleasant at times in the interview Mr. Fisher laughed as he recounted going to the shed to get two knives which he used to stab his son as he stood in Joshua's bedroom, I knew I had to get the jump on him, he was powerful and agile, he said, he's strong and he's fast, I wanted to get the right angle, I think I stabbed him in. The back first photo Ernest Fisher says he killed his son because of his threatening behavior supplied and barn. Son when asked how hard he had stabbed his son he replied hard because I wanted it to go through I had to make it count because if he came at me I would be dead it wasn't a very pleasant sensation stabbing your own son he said. I think I've done the right thing in a twisted sort of way. He was an arsehole. Police asked him how many times he ha. D stabbed his son, and he replied, You need to dig him up and find out. When told he was now going to be under arrest. For murder, he laughed and quipped, I can't go back. Footy was a priority Mr. Fisher said the stabbing happened after. Mr. Fisher Turner had taken his car keys at a time when he wanted to drive to his friend's house to watch the grand fina. L. He said he started to dig a hole in the backyard before leaving the house and going to his friend's where he stayed. For about five hours, I didn't want want to miss it, he said. Footy was a priority. When he got home, Matt was in the Ground, Joshua and Hannah Fisher Turner are accused of burying the body and cleaning up the crime scene. Photo, Math. W. Fisher Turner's body was buried in the family's backyard. Facebook, Matthew Fisher Turner, Mr. Fisher said he believed. The other members of his family were relieved afterwards, claiming Matthew was using a cocktail of drugs and discreet. Being him as a horrible lad and like a terrorist, you can't imagine what it's like being threatened on a continuing basis and being hit. That's the main reason, he told police. Mother's death a catalyst Mr. Fisher said his son had always been a black sheep but after the traumatic death of his wife in March 2014, his son's behavior became worse. Onk. Egil died. It escalated because with her around he was on good behavior. He said he blamed me for not making her go to hospital. But it was her decision. Mr. Fisher rejected suggestions he had killed his son out of spite or revenge. Sa. Ying he couldn't think of anything else to resolve the situation. It's not very nice to kill your son to protect your 
family and yourself. It was sort of the last option, he said. I was upset when I first did it. Christ, yeah, the deed. Dives also suggested that Mr. Fisher could have temporarily moved his family out of the house to get away from Matthew. But he replied, I didn't want to waste money. I've got my own house. I own it. I didn't like the idea of moving. He said, Mr. Fisher has pleaded not guilty to the murder charge and claims the stabbing of his son was done in defense of H himself and his other family members. The trial is expected to finish later this month. Topics Murder and Manslaughter Law Crime and Justice Courts and Trials Armelia 6167 first posted June 15, 2018 17 11 and 6 seconds more stories from Western O.